the Creator has blessed Nine Bin Province with spectacular scenery. Every tree, rack on the scared land bears the stamp of time. And as tourism is identified as the key local economic sector, the value of history and culture has become very important. Trang an ecotourism zone has long been known as a unique cultural site. And it is likened to Halong Bay. It is a complex of beauty landscapes, clouds and mountains and blue water. The unstoppable change of the nature has created a matrix of caves with nine life gates and nine death gates for the Trangan. Tourists seem to be lost in paradise here. Six kilometers away from Nine Bin City, Trangan covers an area of 2,000 hectares consisting of wetland eco-forests, limestone forests, Ho'olu historic sites and a cave system. The number of tourists of Trangan increased constantly from more than 1 million people in 2009 to over 4 million people by 2012. Trang and Boat Station with nearly 1,500 boats is considered the biggest one in Vietnam. There are 1,200 boat women who mainly come from Javin and Hoalu districts. Therefore, Trang and also has the record of having the most boat women in Vietnam. The journey to discover Trang and ecotourism zone starts and ends at the same point. However, the route in and the route out are not the same. It is an interesting difference. The boats take visitors back to the history of Tin Dynasty that used mountains as citadels rivers as roads and caves palaces. And perhaps, the best attraction of Trangan is its spiritual meaning rather than the beauty of blue water. The boat women also desire to explain the history of the place to travelers. The journey is an exploration of ten caves and three spiritual points. If we want to reach the Trin Temple, we have to go through Dark Cave which is as impressive as the literal sense of its name. Without light, we can see nothing in the length of 300 meters of the cave except the sounds of water lapping against the walls. The temperature of the cave is always higher than outside because of a warm underground curry. The Trin Temple is used to worship two generals of Tin Dynasty. The Fukong Temple is used to worship other seven generals of Tin Dynasty. People come here not to conduct noisy rituals but to listen to echoes of distant memories.
arriving at Tran Temple, touching sacred stone pillars, breathing in the fresh air of the primeval forest, people feel as if their worries faded away. Actually, the feeling has already followed them along the journey. In the 260 meter long No Ra'u cave, there is a water well that the ancients used to take water to produce rice wine. The rice wine was very famous for its quality, color and flavor. The most outstanding cave is, perhaps, the Budget Cave. Because of not only its beauty but also its mysterious exotic fable. A man could not get the girl he loved, he came to the cave. Lit a candle on a small turtle's back. He cried three days and three nights and then went to Psy Cave to drown himself. It was so thrilling that the cave burst into tears as stalactite drops. The mother turtle waiting outside the cave became stone. Frangen is considered as outdoor geological museum. The land is approximately 250 million years old in terms of geology. Over a very long period of time, the effects of the earth, the climate, the sea level changes have formed hundreds of valleys, caves, and many species of rare animals and plants. Not only the majestic mountains and rivers, but also the hospitality of the people here make visitors love this land. Every dweller of Trangan is also a tourist guide. Is it the reason why its tourism is growing day by day? Trangan Ecological Zone is documented to be recognized as a World Natural Heritage by UNESCO. 
it will soon become a must-see in traveler's guidebooks. There are still many difficulties facing local people's life in Prangan. However, with great pride in their motherland, they all look towards a better life in the cultural and sacred land. Prangan is a fantastic destination that would linger on forever in our mind once we visit it.